In this video, you'll learn how to create a static filter, create a dynamic filter, apply a filter to a report, and apply a filter to a task. Click End Printing allows you to add static and dynamic filters using values or formulas from Click View or Click Sense. In this example, we have a sales report made using data from ClickView, and we want to filter the result using a specific product category. In this example, we are going to create a new filter. Enter a name for the filter. Select your app. And then click on Create. Once you've created the filter, you can then add specific fields. Select the connection from the drop-down list, and then select the field you want to use as a filter. In this case, we select Category Name. When you start typing in the value section, click and printing searches for matching values from the selected field. Here we select three product categories with which the report results will be filtered. Now we are going to add the new filter to the report. In this case, we update the title of the report to reflect the filtered result. In the Filter tab, we add the new filter to the report. With Click and Printing, you can also create dynamic filters. For example, you can create a filter that uses a formula to filter for the current year. Enter a name for the filter and associate it with an app. Once you've created the filter, you can add fields. As before, select the connection and the field from the drop-down lists. Now you can add the formula to calculate the current year. Each formula must return a single value and use ClickView syntax. Once you've created the filter, you can use it to add to a task. In this example, we are going to create a new task. In the Report tab, we select the Sales Report with the Product Category Filters. Select PDF as the output, and then add the report to the task. Select the user to which you want to send the report. In this example, we select the Admin User. Now you can add the filters that you created to your report. You can add multiple filters to the same report, task, or user, and end printing will filter based on the combination of filters. For the destination, select the newsstand. When done, click on Run Now. Now when you open the newsstand, you will find the report. As you can see, when compared to the original report, the data contained in this report is filtered for the selected product categories, which we added with the first filter, and filtered for the current year, which we added as a dynamic filter. And that concludes this video. Thanks for watching.